Dear Conference, it is Christmas and its joy is in the air. Though the COVID-19 virus still darkens our lives as it spreads its spell as a new variant, the prophecy of Isaiah, the people who lived in darkness, have seen a great light becomes very relevant. The hanging of the stars, the setting of the crib, and the singing of carols, the exchange of gifts and greetings, all pointing to that night when the light dawned upon us, heaven came down to us, Christ was born for us. It is the celebration of the gift of God's perfect love. God so loved the world that he gave his only son. The first Christmas gift was neither bought from a shop nor packed with colorful wraps, but formed in the womb of the virgin and laid in the manger. The humble womb and the simple manger presents to us that God comes to us in humility and simplicity to transform our lives. This mystery which transformed history still continues to transform us, leading from darkness to light. I take this opportunity to appreciate each one of you, dear fathers and brothers, for being the instrument of God in bringing love, light and peace into the lives of the people as you reached out to them by your presence, through the sacraments, and with acts of mercy. May the love of Christ urge us on to bring hope and light into the lives of the people in need. My greetings to all your people at home and the people you serve. Wishing you all a very happy Christmas and grace-filled New Year 2022.